I get excited when I get to talk about music because that's my heart and soul. Songland, talk to me about this. This is greatness. Oh no, they finally did something for songwriters. Nobody has opened the door for the community of a songwriter to have a chance yes. to go straight to the artist, straight to the radio. It literally puts a songwriter in front of a huge artist yeah. and lets them play their song and find out on the spot, what's right and what's wrong about on it. On the spot. We've been peddling our songs for years, and if someone had just been able to say, hey, you know what, your chorus doesn't quite hit hard enough. Right. If we had only known the reasons our songs weren't getting recorded, right. I mean, the world would have opened up. I would change up. all my songs. Yeah. The thing is, you got five people coming on, and at one out of five is guaranteed a song on Jonas Brothers? Guaranteed? What? That's what happens. Why hasn't this happened you know before? What? I, know. I think it takes a lot of cooperation because the fact that they're being able to get Jonas Brothers, Will I Am, Macklemore to sit there and say, hey, I'm going to give a songwriter an opportunity. They're not giving them some small opportunity. No, this is a big this opportunity. Is huge. It Think doesn't about the come life, like this. The lifetime of the copyright. So the song gets recorded by John Legend on the spot, gets oh put out, gosh. and then that songwriter owns that song and also is getting That's, exposure yeah. of exposure. what their personality is like, the of what it's like to write with them. Exposure. This is amazing. It's crazy. And you can tell you two want to look out for other songwriters. And I just love this because yeah. it's like it's a special community, yeah. right? And I feel like songwriters don't get the credit they, they deserve. Don't get the credit. No. Esther yes. had an interview and I was sitting next to her and everybody in the room, she started to talk about that sort of lack of credit that yeah. songwriters have been given. Everyone got teary-eyed because the truth is we're afraid to say we want credit. We're afraid to say, hey, that may be the story of our mother. It was our my sister. sister. Yeah. Or it's my, but the thing is, you give it away and then all of a sudden when they say, oh, you know, congratulations on your new hit, they say thanks. And there's no other body who gets to get the congratulations. You know, our family tell us congratulations. Some of the songs my mom don't even know I wrote. I was like, I wrote that song. And she's like, oh, you did? Which, Girl, which, which, you which, songs, know. <laughs> which songs would you say people don't realize that you wrote? Mr. Know-It-All by Kelly Clarkson. Oh, yeah. Turn Me On by David Guetta. Hey Mama by David Guetta and Nicki Minaj. Little Freak by Usher. They don't know these things because, first of all, I'm not a person who want to be in front of everybody's business. It's because they don't know who did it, they don't know who to call. You know, so, so you might have wrote the song that's a hit, but if they didn't tell people what the name was, they'll just, they won't, they won't get the next call. How about for you, Shane? What's some of the work that you feel that people don't realize or credit well, you? Well, it's hard you for me to say. You got 38 number ones first. 38 number ones, so Wait, I... Wait, <sighs> hold on. I know! 38. <laughs> yeah. I certainly right. have no problem taking credit, so some of the songs that I wrote are Body Like a Back Road for Sam Hunt, right. Rainbow for Casey Musgraves, American Kids for Kenny Chesney, Mama's Broken Sheesh. Heart for Miranda Lambert. I'm, uh, you know, mostly working in the country Sheesh. world. The thing is, we are excited that they take these songs and that they shine a light on our work. But what an amazing thing now to flip it and these songwriters that get to come in and they are getting to tell their stories yeah. and why they wrote these songs. I really think that it's gonna change oh, things. Beautiful. Yeah, it's shining a light on a different part of the music industry. It's a community. There's so many songwriters out there that I'm for sure don't know that there's even a lane for you. Right. You know, you just think artists write their songs and that's it. But there's some little girl, there's some little boy who's writing these songs out of their head and don't know what to do with it. We are absolutely showing them, not only do we have a place for you, the door's open. Oh my gosh, this is big. Yeah, it is. It is big. It is I wouldn't have did it if it wasn't. Like, oh yeah, no, Because you're giving big. your secrets. Yes. You sit there and you sing and you're like, okay, I like what you did, but I would do this right here. So it's a give and take right on the screen. And normally you keep that stuff to yourself. And you know, it's, it's the giving back. I didn't know how to give back as a songwriter. I was like, where am I going? You mm. want me to just how take people off back? the street and just start trying to mentor them into what I do? But this has given me a safe place to service my community and my community oh, songwriting. And this. approaching it that way actually makes it so fun yeah. because at the end of every episode, you feel like you did something for someone. It, it really does feel like we got to use years yeah. of hard work and, right. and, and the right kind of struggle. I mean, that's right. part of it, yeah. but just saying, you know, if someone had just said this to me, mm -hmm. yes. uh, maybe some of this would have been a little easier and a little more fun. So that's what we're trying to and do. And it helps people who've got kids who do music and you're like, yeah. hey, mom and dad, this is what they want to do. And yes, oh. there's success in this. And there's a real career there's behind a career. songwriting. Right. There's I'm, a real career. You can really do it. My dreams are literally coming true right now. Like, 
Woo. You guys, thank you so much. I'm excited about Songland. I think it's about time, it's important. And from a music lover, I thank you too because yes. without songwriters, literally life would be so boring. It There's no music without you guys. Thank so you. thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Of course. Yeah, so Love sweet. you guys. Can we hug through this? Yes, yeah, Oh, hug. I like this yes. stoop hug.